Hello and welcome. This is Double R, and just in front of me is the Bull and Bladder, the first original Bathams pub. And this is where I start the journey on the Delph run. So we will be heading in this direction. I hope you all enjoy the video. So just walking away from the Bull and Bladder and heading down here towards the Black Horse pub on the Delph run. I am with Adventures of Chris today. He's just in front doing his video. And just over the road there is the Black Horse. <laughs> I've been informed this was known as the Delft Run. There was a consecutive row of pubs in a line. They have Sky Sports and under new management. We are now just approaching the 10th lock. We did a few, a few months back, we did a video. Um, we did a walk along the locks and our video finished at the 10th lock, just here. Another beautiful pub. And just here, past the 10th lock, we have the locks themselves. Yes, a few few months ago, um, might have been last year, we, uh, we did a video and we come down that path from the top and uh, we filmed the locks. And each lock has a number on. Just here, Delft Bottom Lock. There's a little map here, Dudley's number one trail, it's a little bit dirty. The changing landscape. Our walk continues just over the island and straight down that road.
We've just gone past Turner's Lane and just over there in the distance is the Whittemore Sainsbury's. So we're just nearing the Sainsbury's. There's a little walk, dog walking area and park just on the opposite side of the road. I am with Adventures of Chris today. If you've not been on his channel, I do uh, recommend it. He does some fantastic videos. And today's video really we're just walking round. We've just done a couple of pubs on the Delft run. And then we're just heading down past the Sainsbury's. As there's a lovely little walk and a pool. Just straight ahead. And I thought it'd make for a nice little scenic video. And just there, Sainsbury's Amble Coat. There's a petrol garage as well, as you can see. And this road is only for buses, taxis, and cyclists. I've just come across this missing cat. Such a shame. someone's beloved pet has got missing so if you know any information or if you've seen the cat contact the number that was on the poster And here we have the little uh, lake area. Or pool. Not so much a lake, more of a pool. Water's edge now. An old Tati Tesco carrier bag been washed up. Just over here where the water trickles through just stationed in the middle of an housing estate nice little walk just to get here it's beautiful to say it's a bit overcast today there's a few grey clouds it is rather warm but I would say perfect day for filming so what we're going to do we're going to walk around all the way around and then hopefully come out just up here I think on a nice hot day underneath this tree or this tree here be a nice little location for a picnic you've got the water just down down there in front here 
as we continue our walk we'll go there is a path just there but you can follow the grass and walk round we've just been joined by some geese As we continue the walk round, another little lovely grass spot, grassy spot I should say, bit of shade from the trees, there's a beautiful view, and there's a pigeon just up there. Just over in the distance, the playing room boy. a dog walker behind us if you have got a dog this is a beautiful bit of walk and scenery so the grass areas round here really nice this is the trail we've just walked and then carry on just along here and right over the back there is where we just was is the other side of the lake and we'll be taking that path just there and walking back round such beauty in a nice on a nice housing estate a lovely place to walk your dog or just have a have a walk yourself or if you like cycling ride your bike around look at this tree I will advise there is quite a few thorns and nettles about and just there I think if I can capture it and butterfly fluttering around and as we continue round bit of a more wilder grass area I have read about this people letting the wildflowers and grass grow longer to help wildlife And just over here, there's geese and ducks. And three pigeons. All rested on the banks. Just how peaceful. You've got all these little wildflowers. Some daisies just here, and the ducks are just chilling. Nice warm summer's day. You can 
continue along the the grass bank some quite a few different flowers a few bees about as well just gonna head up towards the path area Here, if I'm careful, there's some baby little ducklings. Might just zoom in. I've got a bee round by me. Just chilling in the pond. How beautiful is that? And just got back to near where we started. Nice little summer stroll around the pool, seeing some ducks, seeing some baby ducks, a few geese, a couple of butterflies, and some wallflowers. And the clouds are starting to part a little bit. And now we're gonna have five minutes and head back the way we came. Pop into the Sainsbury's for a quick coffee and then head home. It is really getting warm now. Whoo! That sun. Oh dear. really close and muggy and it's only about 11 am 11 if that maybe a bit lighter just got into the Starbucks I have myself a flat white and this is where I'm going to end the video I hope you've all enjoyed I will be, be back again soon and uh, all have a great weekend.